We'll look in closer detail at the deltoid muscle, the big power muscle of the shoulder. It arises from the acromion, which is a shelf of bone arising from the scapula, the shoulder blade. So here is the acromion, and the muscle is a very broad and triangular shaped muscle. It spreads out to the front and it spreads out to the back and it runs down and attaches to the tubercle in the middle of the humerus. This is the front part of the deltoid muscle and you can see that it attaches all the way around to the collarbone and it covers the front of the shoulder. It is very common for people to have pain in the front of their shoulders. When people come in to see me, they will put their hand over the front of the shoulder, point just at this area and say it really hurts and it hurts when I do particular movements, often reaching forward or reaching behind your back, woman, if you're trying to undo your bra, that will stretch triggers and it will set off pain. Activities which require forceful movements. So a lot of sporting activities where skiing, when you, when you especially cross-country skiing, where you're using your poles a lot, where you do lots of heavy lifting, carrying little babies around that can, um, or increasingly bigger babies around can often set these triggers off. Often injections are given into the deltoid and the substances that are injected can be really fairly toxic to muscle and therefore they may set off trigger points in this muscle. The trigger points occur usually here, here and there. So it's in the central portion of the muscle and the pain tends to be local. So you will feel the pain here primarily, but it may radiate down the arm slightly. So that is the pain pattern of triggers in the anterior portion or the front portion of the deltoid muscle.